In this video today, I'm going to show you how you can crop and zoom into an object of interest in a video clip and follow the movement of that object using CyberLink PowerDirector 19. First, you want to click and drag your clip down onto the timeline. Then you want to make sure that your clip is selected. Come up to Tools and select Crop Zoom Pan. Now in the Crop Zoom Pan window, you want to click the corner and resize to how you want to zoom it. Then select or hover over this little blue circle in the middle so that you can click and drag your zoomed area to the area of interest. Now to follow this particular object, what you'll want to do is start playing your video clip until you get to a place where you're going to want to add your first keyframe. And so I'm going to add my first keyframe right here where the tractor has stopped moving. And so I'm going to add a keyframe, which is this right here. And then I'm going to hover over that blue area, then I'm going to click and drag to move that keyframe to the new area. Now you've noticed that the first keyframe is the area where we started, and the second keyframe, it draws an arrow to where your second keyframe is. And what that's going to do is it's going to follow the motion of your object of interest from the first keyframe to the second keyframe. So if you've got a video clip that has more complex movement of your object of interest, you would just need to add more keyframes and just move your video from keyframe to keyframe to keyframe to keyframe. And that's how you could follow your zoomed in uh, area. And you could maybe even zoom out and adjust your zoomed area at your different keyframes. So at this point, we're just going to click OK in the crop zoom pan window. And so now when we play, uh, press play on our video clip, it will follow our object of interest from part A to part B in the zoomed in area that we have selected. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Bye.